नमो नम सर्वेभ्यो नमस्कार शुभोदय टुडे इज द फिफ्थ डे ऑफ अवर क्लासेस ऑन योग बाय विश्व योग विद्यापीठ लेड बाय सी एस आर प्रभुगर अवर एकेडमिक डायरेक्टर and his team bridge bhushan garu and ravi kumar garu uh, we will start the webinar after uh, um, chanting uh, reciting vande mataram and chanting prarthana tala chitti prabhu garu please say vande mataram वंदे मातरम वंदे मातरम सुजला सुबला मलय जसीतला सस्य श्यामला मातरम वंदे मातरम सुब्रज्योत्स्नाकुसुमितुमदशोभिनी सुहासिनी सुमधुरभाषिणी सुखदा वरदा मतर वंदे मतर वंदे मातर वंदे मातर धन्यवाद चलाबाब नाउ लेट अस रिक्वेस्ट विश्वनाथ गारु टू चांड प्रार्थना प्लीज हरि ओम सर्वे भ्यो नमस्कार ऑडिबल यू आर ऑडिबल गो हेड ओम गणपति हवामहे कवि कवीनामुपम श्रवस्तम ज्येष्ठराज ब्रह्मण ब्रह्मणस्पत आनश्रण्वनूति ओं श्री महागणाधिपत नम फॉट लेट स्टार्ट विद मेडिटेशन लेट कीप अवर बैक स्ट्रेट एंड पार्शली क्लोज अवर आईज and focus on your breath for 1 minute for doing meditation धन्यवाद नाउ लेट अस चैंट ओम थ्री टाइम्स लेट अस टेक अ डीप ब्रेथ एंड स्टार्ट चैंटिंग ओम वाइल एक्सेलिंग स्लोली एंड लेट अस एक्सपीरियंस तुरुया द साइलेंस बिटवीन द टू ओंकारास एंड एंजॉय इट ओ
धन्यवाद लेटस डू प्रार्थना ओम गणना गणपति हवामहे कवि कवीनामुपम श्रवस्तम ज्येष्ठराज ब्रह्मण ब्रह्मणस्पत आन शोदिधाधन ओं श्री महागणाधिपत नम ओ प्रणोदेवी सरस्वती वाजेभिर्वाजिनी वती दीनामित्रवत ओं श्री महासरस्वत नम गुरुरे गति गुरमे भजे गुरुण सहास्मो नमो गुरव न गुरो परम शिशुरस्म गुरो मतिरस्ति गुरो मां पा गुरो नानंदमय देव निर्मल स्फटिकाकृति आधारम सर्व विद्याग्रीव मुस्मे श्रुति स्मृति पुराण आल करुणाल नमा भगवत्द शंकर लोकशंक शंकर शंकराचार्य केशव बादरायण सूत्र भाष्य वंदे भगवत पुनः पुनः ईश्वरो गुरुरात्मे मूर्ति भेद विभागिने व्योम व्याप्तहाय दक्षिणामूर्त नम असतो मद्गमय तमसो मोतिर्गमय मृत्योर्मा अमृत गमय ओं शाति 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 मातृदेव भव पितृदेव भव आचार्य देव भव अतिथिदेव भव ओ सहनावत सह मुभुन सह वीर करवाह तेजस्वीनावधीतमस्तु मेदेशा वह ओ शाति 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 धन्यवाद हरि ओम धन्यवाद मी विश्वनाथ गार धन्यवाद thank you so much thank you sir. now uh, let us you know request brujbhushan pro prohit garu to start the webinar please yes sir namaste sir namaste and brujbhushan garu namaste good morning subodayam subodayam is it clear and audible clear and audible okay uh once again a very good morning to all uh, we are going to have the practice of uh, today's session the uh, earlier two three sessions you have gone through some basic moments first day i took uh, a little bit introduction on yoga the whole philosophy of yoga anyhow prabhu sir is taking for you all so we will be going only directly to the practical part of it no doubt theory and practical go together in yoga practices mana bharatiya sanskruti lo there are two important darshanas which are related to this topic one is uh, sankhya darshanam and another which is directly that is the yoga darshana sankhya darshana is the theory part we can say 
and what is theory written in sankhya that is reflected into practical in the yoga darshana how to realize the purpose of the whole process is to realize the uh, reality <laughs> and reality is nothing but the brahman the god the research when they did all our wishes what is going to remain permanent that is real satya sat word comes from that so to reach that stage the yoga is the method and the root for that there are so many spirituality and so many other methods by which we are going to that level there are so many other ways like gyana yoga bhakti yoga raj yoga so many so many different different approaches are there later on for a common man for a common it has been developed as a hatha yoga the hatha yoga is the actually the balance of two energies the positive and negative which is there in the nature also in our body also and the purpose of doing this balancing is to reach that final goal only so the body is the tool for that sharira madhyam khalu dharma sadhanam so body is the starting point and yoga is nothing but it is a spiritual development only but it is a creative expression of spirituality yoga it is a creative development సృజనాత్మకమైన ఒక భావం అనుకోండి బికాస్ ద క్రియేటివిటీ ఓన్లీ మేక్స్ అస్ ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ అండ్ ద పర్పస్ ఆఫ్ హోల్ యోగా సిస్టమ్ ఈస్ టు మేక్ అవర్ మైండ్ టు గో టువర్డ్స్ దట్ మైండ్ ఈస్ ద టూల్ అనదర్ ఇంటర్నల్ టూల్ విచ్ లీడ్స్ టు ద రియాలిటీ అండ్ ఇన్ దట్ ప్రాసెస్ ద ఫిజికల్ పార్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఇట్ ది హఠ యోగా actually it goes with the cleaning processes shatkarmas which i think uh, i will give a little introduction uh, today or tomorrow but already prabhu sir will be taking up for you like sanka prakshalana and other kriyas and vomiting and all this vamana etc etc uh, then comes the asanas asana is the another important part which deals with the Uh, hatha yoga then pranayama the breath control and then comes the mudra and bandhas in hatha yoga these are the some basic things which come in the practical part another very important part from out of all these combinations a very good designed uh, structure of yogic sukshma vyayama is also designed for the people particularly swami kartikeyan ji who was the, the guru of swami dhirendra brahmachari and from swami dhirendra brahmachari our guru ji sri chori raga dikshit lu ji he has uh, got this knowledge and from there like this guru parampara prabhu sir and all that we all learn from our guru ji so sri sukshma vyayama is also a very good very important uh, set of uh, exercises which will be dealt by our prabhu sir only a little bit part of it you have experienced ravi kumar sir has given you some breathing exercises some small movements preparatory movements uh, in the two days of classes first day i gave you some few asanas some few movements now let us start with the same repetition and then we will go for some more asanas today now first sit straight a small small shithilikarana vyayama or relaxation or preparatory movements for your important joints of the body first move your head and neck right side talanu pootiga right side chain then left side fully move your head on the right circle omai left side again to the right side 
left side right breathe in and then breathe out on the side simply breathe in center breathe out again to the side breathe in center now exhale down inhale up exhale down inhale up exhale down inhale up then come back in the middle and relax towards your shoulder ear to the shoulder first breathe in and go there and exhale return back go to the other side exhale and return breathe in exhale to the side and return breathe in again breathe out center to the side exhale try to stay over there for few seconds feel the stretch a stretch ni feel change then come back breathe in again on the other side breathe out and go there be for some time kuch samay wahan rukna then return back relax now get ready for a circular movement head down breathe out here exhale from your right side start full breathe in inhale and from other side exhale and come back reverse inhale a big circle chakrakaram purtiga breathe out एक दिशा से प्रारंभ कीजिए सांस भरते हुए ऊपर दूसरी दिशा से वापस आ जाइए अगेन ए वन मोर सर्कल फुली डाउन वंस वन मोर वंस फ्रॉम राइट साइड वंस फ्रॉम लेफ्ट साइड ए बिग सर्कल try to move your whole neck region in sukshma vyayama this is griva shakti vikasaka now relax next keep your hands on the knees rotate your shoulders shoulder round circle tail the rotation of your shoulder joints you can inhale up exhale down breathe in up breathe out down upar saans le niche chhode paina shwas tiskon kindo dala रिवर्स डायरेक्शन ऑल्सो उल्टा भी कर ले दिस विल प्रिपेयर योर शोल्डर जॉइंट फॉर एनी अदर फर्दर मूवमेंट एंड फॉर फ्रोजन शोल्डर नेक प्रॉब्लम जॉइंट प्रॉब्लम आर्थराइटिस ऑल सच प्रॉब्लम कैन बी prevented controlled and cured now do a little alternate movement like a cycle this way stretch it 
and do the cycling action at the shoulder level, like a paddle. Then reverse also. If anyone feels any trouble at any point, you can relax in between and you can skip off some of the things. According to your age, your body, uh, how much it cooperates, me shakti prakaranga chayindi, apni shakti anuchar, anything. Relax. Put your fingers on the hands. Pull, rotate them. Inhale up, exhale down. Shwasatai is kondi, kindu adalind. Breathe in, breathe out. Inhale and exhale. Reverse direction totally. Do a nice movement to your shoulders. But give full movement. Don't do small movements. It should be a total action. So that your shoulders will get a total movement. Relax. Rest. Few deep breaths. Now, let us stand up. Nilabadandi. Now, stretch your arms. Purna Bhuja Shakti Vikasa. <clears throat> stretch your hands. Breathe in. Breathe in. Breathe in. And take it up, maximum inhalation. Lalang chutalo, mastilak, arms. Breathe out, breathe out, breathe out, totally. Mali, shwasati skondi. Take a long deep breath. Then slowly exhale. Once again, take a deep breathing. Full shwasa pilastu. Malli shwasa odli tikinda. Rest for a while. Resting in the standing position, keep your legs separate, hands, palms open like this. Whenever you want to rest, take deep breaths here, lumbi swase, long deep breaths, dirga swasamo, shithila tadasana, shithila tadasana, relaxed tadasana pose. Now, Join the legs once again. Take your hands in front, mutti bandhe. Take the fist, thumbs inside. Now, if possible, breathe in and stop. Otherwise, with breathing, rotate it fully. Chakrakaram. Round according to your capacity. Apni shakti anusar. Dono haathon ko gol ghumai. Rotate, 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 and then finally bring near the chest. Breathe out with the fourth and relax for it. Now do the reverse direction. Same. Either breathe in and stop or normal, you can do anyway. Go Kumar. Rotate your hand. Rotate same. And finally, relax. Now, rest for a while again, deep breathing. 
वंस अगेन डी ब्रेथ फिर लंबी सांसे अंदर लेकर छोड़िए स्टैंड ऑन बोथ द लेग्स दोनों पैरों पे बैलेंस नाउ जॉइन द लेग्स वी विल गो फॉर द वेस्ट द जॉइंट्स ऑफ द वेस्ट ब्रीद इन what you have to do is take a deep breath and then forward bending meek we line anta jitna aap jhuk sakte jhuki from the lower back breathe out if possible hands drop and bend forward get up slowly breathe in breathe in and little back side keep your eyes open carefully thoda piche then come back in the normal once again inhale exhale slowly drop your body down into strength as much as possible it becomes pada hastasana if you can maintain full or whatever possible jitna hua utna get up take a deep breath or slow breathing in and a little back return back to the center once more breathe out try to go down try to touch your feet or the floor whatever possible mix up join them jitna ho sakta hai utna jhukiye get up dheere dheere inhale and little back side try to go back come back in the normal condition breathe out rest now keep your legs little apart duram betan as per your body condition jitna aapse ho sakta hai same way try to bend one jhukna jitna jhuk sakte hai jhuko if you want drop your hands or there only me ke anta sadhya anta chahiye jitna aapse hota hai then get up inhale and here also balance and little back little arch return back in the normal and breathe out once more inhale exhale exhale and go down if any point you are feeling tired or exhausted please relax then get up slowly mel laga devandi and back side then return back in the center now bend your one leg and join another keep your leg separate and relax for now keep a small gap hands front kati chakrasana move your body waist to your right side one exhale inhale center exhale twist it inhale center exhale 
center. Exhalation on the side. And inhaling back to the center. One more time. Swap over the landing. Swapati skondi. Once again, exhale. And return. Relax again. Rest for a while. Now, join your legs or small gap between the legs. Hands front. All of you make a chair position as if you are sitting on the chair. Utkatasana. Bend your knees. We were doing these all in our schooling days. Our teachers used to punish. Nowadays, no, but we had this. This is a very nice asana to strengthen your knees and thighs. Come up, exhale. Our first breathing, exhale and down. Stay there. Stay there, Agandhi. And up. Relax and rest. Take rest, deep breathing. Now take your hands on the waist. Legs together or a small gap. Raise your heels up and down. Heels up and down. Heels up and down. Heels up and down. You even you can do the little feet movement from ankles front and back. But balance. For balancing, you have to look in front one point without losing the balance of the body. Relax. Rest. Deep breathing. So like this, we will prepare our body and joints with this small, small movements, small exercises. Some asanas, all combination. <laughs> now, let us prepare for some asanas. Join the legs, a small gap, or you can keep a small gap or join them. Hands interlock, stretch it front, and from there up. Paina Lagandi, Upar Kichana. Stretch your arms, breathe in, raise your heels up, balance, balance. For balancing, naturally you have to fix your eyes at one point, then gradually down. Once more, breathe in, Paika Lagandi. Inhale, stretch, stretch your body, sharir ko jitna hota hai upar ki taraf khiche. Exhale, drop your hands down from the sides. Rest for a while, deep breathing. Slow deep breaths. Now, one more asana, if possible, whatever possibility, you can prepare yourself. A balancing posture, Vrikshasana, Vrikshasana Karenga. All of you join the legs, firmly place your feet on the floor, floor with a firm, but those who are feeling difficulty, please don't go for them. You have to 
take your one leg, right leg first, and place it on your left thigh, actually nearer to the perineum, and Thorsten, balance your hands in Namaste. If possible, slowly stretch your hands up and stay there for a few moments, breathing and stretch and normal. Again, slowly down, slowly place your legs down. Try change It's a balancing posture. Body and mind balance. Now, let us move to the other side. Try on your other leg. Dusra pe. Slowly catch your ankle. Place it on the thigh. And then namaste. If balance is there, hands up. Eyes fixed in front. Then slowly down. And then slowly drop your leg down. You have to stay into the posture for some time. Rest. This is Vrakshasana, which makes your body stable, mind also stable for concentration practice. Next. Again, your legs separate. We will go for Trikonasana. Turn your right leg on the right side. Right leg, little right side. But keep your waist in the center. Kamar vese hi rakhi. Hands stretch out. Inhale and slowly see that you are bending on the side. Down, down. And take it to your hands in one line. Look up. Trikona asana, the side stretch. Full. Return. And drop your hands down. Turn your leg. Now to be done on other side. Dusre side me karin. Bring your other leg on the side. Keep your waist in the middle only. Hands stretch it. Breathe in. Inhale. Exhale. Let it be on the lateral bending, side bending, not front. Side low on that. Total side stretch. Look up. Final pose, breathing normal. Once again, come back, breathe in. Drop your hands. Turn your leg good. Now, slowly join the legs. Relax. Rest for a while. Deep breaths. Now, sit down. These are all standing posture. We will go for sitting postures. Legs straight, little shake your legs, kaldu moment, pada chalanamu. Now from here, join your legs, come to the dandasana, hands at the side and sitting straight. This is Dandasana, the preparatory or starting stiti for sitting postures. Now, 
bring your feet near padalu kalipi degar teesukondi panjon ko milake nazdik le lijiye keep your legs near to the perineum butterfly posture we call it pakshi kriya or titli asana hands catch your feet body straight Shariramu straight bitten. Little movements as a butterfly. For your hip and knee joints. Your all hip joints. Very nice asana. Particularly for our sisters. Mata behnao ke liye bhaat hi achcha asana mein ginti hoti. For all the, not only for ladies but also for gents also now press your legs down if possible hands here otherwise there only that becomes the bhadrasana bhadranga uncharam bhadra is to save your all the internal organs the indriyas to be kept in a very safe condition control over the indriyas bhadrasana try to stay there in that condition try to do the little movement to your anal muscles maladwaramu lopala baita chain try to contract your anal muscles urinary organs in and out contracting and releasing chain do the contracting movements that becomes ashwini mudra for many disorders of internal organs prostate gland sexual disorders urinary problems menstruation problems such any kind of troubles now meek veelainanta jitna ho sakta hai aage jhuki bend forward full baddha kona asana as much as possible you can go as per your capacity जितना आपकी शक्ति है उसके अनुसार झुको स्ट्रेच इज प्रोवाइडेड हियर इनहेल एंड कम बैक नाउ रिलैक्स स्ट्रेच आउट योर लेग्स फॉल्डू थी शेड if possible from here adapt the padmasana padmasana gurinchi a small movement you can do if somebody is not able to do do this movement first one one leg catch your knee and do the other the padmasana is a beautiful asana and very important for the further steps of going into yoga higher level practices particularly the meditation dhyan ke liye you can do these all movements to get the asana but don't force your legs slowly gradually itla movements kuda chesukondi dheere dheere is tarike se movement kar lijiye rotation and then swing into the sides catch them nicely as if you are catching a baby and you are giving the movement to a small baby relax do with your other leg vere kaalla tho kuda atla ne cheskondi do your movement with the other leg
then rotate it nicely the hip joint and knee joint ghutna aur kulha dono ko bhi movement karna hai ni mokalu tarvata hip joint ni kuda poortiga movement cheyadam preparatory for the padmasana then gradually do little side weights mellaga sides lo cheyandi now whichever leg is easier to you aa kaalu first pettandi jo pair aapko pehle acha lag raha hai use rakhi if anybody not getting the full padmasana like this cross they can do the half one try to do the full padmasana sit straight chin mudra this is the pose for meditation dhyan ke liye upayog mein aane ke liye two three deep breaths now hold your one wrist with the other एक हाथ से दूसरे हाथ को पीछे पकड़ लें स्ट्रेच योर चेस्ट अप श्वास तीस को ब्रीद इन वाई चेन्डी इफ एनीबडी इज नॉट गेटिंग पद्मासना लेट इट बी सुखा आर वन कैन बी इन टू द वज्रासन आल्सो वज्रासन लो कूड़ा chest bend and touch your head on the floor and slowly get up slowly get up once again breathe out exhale yoga mudra and inhale relax rest for a while deep breathing you have to observe every movement internally feel the movements feel the changes me marpulanu शरीर अमन प्रति सारी मन अखे उ अपने मन को पूरा ध्यान लगा के करें ट्राइ टू परफॉर्म विथ कॉन्सट्रेशन एंड अवेरने कॉन्सट्रेट एंड डू relax and sit comfortably now stretch out your legs kaldu malli straight and chest rest for a while deep breathing for resting This is the Nishpand Bhavasana or Sitila Dandasana. Long and deep breaths. now we will go for little 
supine lying posture i will introduce for you all a basic four asanas which one can do on your bed itself mee bed meedane ee naalugo asanalu cheskunte morning when you get up as you all know how to start our dinacharya ayurveda prescribes about the dinacharya pratah uthana that is you have to get up early in the morning in the brahma murtamo that we all know get up early in the morning on the bed itself you can perform few asanas which will make you alert and fresh because the night nowadays our lifestyle our indian lifestyle bhartiya sanskruti bahut hi alag thi we all forgot into the modernization even you see the all animals or birds still they follow the prakruti niyama prakruti ka niyam hota you may be knowing everybody a few days back one of my student i went to him to their house there was a small sparrow chhota sa chidiya ko pal rahe the it was actually very big, newly born and it was fell down somewhere they brought it and they started feeding them and it was very small they could not fly or ling even legs are also are not there and when i was leaving they said sir abhi 6 baj gaya hai this is the time for feeding them after 6 o'clock they won't eat once the sun sets the small sparrow वो बोलता है छह बजे के बाद में कुछ नहीं खाता सर रात में सो जाती बट दे विल सिट लाइक दैट इवन इफ यू फीड देम दे विल नॉट सो दे आर मोर बेटर देन अस एंड वी ऑल हैव बिकम सो मॉडर्न दैट वी आर ऑल टेकिंग द फूड इवन द नाइट ट्वेल्व ओ क्लॉक इलेवन ओ क्लॉक विच इज कॉल्ड एज राक्षसी भोजन अमो सो लेट एस एडॉप्ट दैट फ्यू सो ड्यू टू दैट मॉर्निंग ब्रह्म मुहूर्तमो लेवड़ो मन कष्टम सो आयुर्वेद डिस्क्रैब ब्रह्म मुहूर्त एंड ऑन द बेड इट से इन ऑर्डर टू गेट रिड ऑफ आल दी डेस इन युअर बॉडी देर आर फ्यू आसना वी कैन अडॉप्ट एंड मेक अवर से रेडी टू गेट अप एंड दीज आसना देर आर फोर आसना विच वी मेन्शन which you can do on the bed itself akade bistar par hi kar sakte and these four asanas are pavana mukta asan first tana asana second paschimottana asana third and again sitting pavana mukta asana fourth let us do those four asanas and then you can just see once and then you can do one by one how to perform these asana please observe it first one has to lie down padkovali padkuna tarvata that is shavasana you all know many people call it as a shanti asana or mrutasana or amrutasana some people the word shavasana or mrutasana use take on the shanti asana amrutasana because it gives you the high level of relaxation so legs will be separate hands will be away from your body palms are open eyes are closed this is the shavasana or amrutasana relaxation we'll do in the last now from here join the legs kallu kalapandi hands near what you have to do is raise your right leg this is uttana padasana breathe in bend your leg slowly and catch with both the hands pressure on your abdomen pressure ichi baga pressure ivandi against your abdomen breathe out there if you are able to do raise your head and touch the chin to the knee keep your other leg straight 
breathe out there. Once again, bring it straight, head down, breathe in, and then in, exhale and put it down. Same thing with the left leg, raise up, inhale, exhale, pressure, breathe out, chin to the knee. If you can't do, let your head be down. If your neck is paining, neck problem unte talakinda. Then slowly stretch your leg again back and breathe in and relax down. Now both the legs, you have to raise your both the legs, fold, pressure, breathe out, chin to the knee. This is the full Pavanamuktasana. Here, if possible, you can swing your body. Front and back, you can swing if possible. Otherwise, don't do. Same way, roll your body on the right and left side. Alage right and left kuda chayan. Do the movement to the sides. Relax. Now come in the middle and rest. <laughs> now, all of you start. Chayan. All of you, please begin this asana. I think all of you understood. Please do it. Raise your... Join the legs. Raise your right leg. Breathe in. Inhale. Exhale. Hold. Little below the knee. Catch it. Achhi taral se pakadalo. Catch it nicely. Pressure. Chin to the knee. If your any problem is not there. Relax. Breathe in. And down. Exhale. Do with the other nostril. Uh, sorry, other leg. Bend, breathe out. Touch your chin to the knee. Exhale. Pressure is chi, exhale, change. Release, breathe in, inhale. And down. Then both the legs. Breathe in. Hold. Exhale. Pressure. What am I the pressure even? Pet ko acha dabai. Give the pressure. And wait for some time. Now, if possible, swing your body. Make wheel aite. Ogan. अगर आपसे होता है तो करिए नहीं होता है एनी एज प्रॉब्लम एनी अदर ट्रबल्स डोंट डू रोल टू योर साइड्स दिस इज अ वन राउंड वन कैन डू टू थ्री राउंड्स एस पर योर कैपेसिटी एंड टाइम्स समय अनुसार एक या दो राउंड ऐसे कर लेना है Relax. Stop the movement and then slowly stretch out your legs and then place it down. Shavasana. Take rest. Relax total. Dhyan Diji. Concentrate. Now, join your legs. Put your hands straight above the head. Dono haathon ko upar leke jai. Toes, let it be pointed down. And fingers of your hands pointed up. Mi chetulan talamida. Poor tiga feel, look at a lagutu pattern. 
स्ट्रेच योर हैंड्स अबाउ स्ट्रेच हाथों को खींची ब्रीद इन इन हील एंड रिलीज नाउ लेग्स पॉइंटेड डाउन इन हील एंड रिलीज नाउ होल बॉडी लेग्स डाउनवर्ड हैंड्स अपवर्ड एवरो पटको लागत As if somebody is pulling your whole body in both directions. Breathe in, inhale, stretch, stretch your body, stretch your body nicely, and slowly relax. Rest in shavasana. This is the Tanasana, Talasana. Different, different. Some people they have, or Yastikasana, or Jastika. There are different four names. Stretching of your posture, Sharir ko kichana, which we do normally in our bed, or getting up. We are doing it proper. The whole nervous system. the muscular system and joints to be stretched now third posture actually you have to do if anybody is having back pain or any type of trouble in your spine hunch back slip disc please don't do the next asana what do you have to do is how to get up from the bed just fold your left leg little right hand below the head and turn your body to the right side or left side also and then place your palm in front and get up lazy kuchwa this is the method you have to get up now the third asana how to get up another posture those who are okay paschimottana asana Hands above the head, stretch it nicely. What Tanasan we did, breathe in full and get up, bend forward, front bending. Try to do the front bending as much as possible. Front bending chain. You can bend forward and then again you can go back. Breathe in. and then you can repeat again those who are okay try to do get up bend forward those who are not able to do even though they don't have any problem they can do same asana sitting hands up raise your hands fully up stretch your hands up sitting and from there you can bend forward as much as possible front bending stay there try to end from your lower back jhukna aage ki taraf jhuk ke koshish kijiye sharir ko mod relax now put your hands back and shithila dandasana or nispanda bhavasana deep breathing now we have done the three fourth one join your legs dandasana hands at the side of your thighs fold your right leg one what you have done sleeping same pavana mukta asana catch press on the abdomen pet ko dabao chin to the knee inhale stretch out Two. Left leg. Three. Exhale. Pressure. Four. Both the legs. Five. Pressure. Six. Inhale. Rest. So like this, these four asanas you can do on the bed. 
sometimes still if you feel dull a one more asana can be added to it mola vadkwa you have to lie down on your chest or abdomen pet ke bal let jana that is actually the makara asana hands folded below the chin and keep your legs separate and pointed out little kallu baitiki pettandi this is makara asana the crocodile posture resting pose in the prone lying posture ulta let ke kiye jane wale asano mein ye resting pose hai when you are supine lying shavasana when you are sitting shithil dandasana when you are standing shithil tadasana these are all relaxing poses now sthiti join your legs what you have to do is you can observe once viparita pavana muktasana is done here little difficult for some of you those who have difficulty in body movements <laughs> you have to place your hands near the chest there are actually two three asanas indirectly combined here bhujangasana and others so what you have to do is first you can see breathe in and lift your whole body up and then bend your knees and go back body little back and fold your right leg below the stomach no 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 hmm fold your one leg pressure below the chest and bring your head down bring your head down stomach is pressed other leg is straight now breathe in again head up bring your leg back and then go down now do with the left leg alaj that becomes bhujangasana first breathe in slowly then fold your knee little and left leg down below the body pressure and head down full pressure and head down you will get extra pressure on your abdomen potamida again breathe in and then bring your leg down you can see the lot of movement on your legs and body joints once again breathe in raise the up now bring one by one both the legs one leg then another leg pressure and down this becomes sashankasan also now sit straight in that condition aa sthiti lo straight urchandi vajrasana this is the only one asana which you can do perform after eating after food just sit down like this ila kurchan those who feel any trouble they can avoid this like knee pains or fractures unte vadle if anybody is feeling trouble only in sitting you can keep some pillow or soft material below the legs and joints ala this is a again meditative posture eyes closed observe your body deep breathing now some breathing practices we will introduce tomorrow some more asanas will be added we will try to learn within one or two days more is not possible this much will be helpful for you most of you normally to do the your regular day to day practice turn front now in this position just spread your legs out little and keep your body straight once again we will do the ashwini mudra what i told earlier all of you contract your anal muscles and release contract release anal muscles this is a very important exercise for 
all the internal problems. Contracting your anal muscles. One, two, three, four, five, six. Like that. Maladwaram. Maladwaram ko andar bahar sankuchan ki ji. Around 30-40 times now. Later on, on your own, you can practice about 100, 200, 300 times. Regular practice will help you to get rid of many, many problems which cannot be expressed to others. Maladwaram. After 30 or 40 counts, just contract and stop. Maladwaram. Lopal ki maladwar ko andar ki taraf khichiye or rok li. Stop your contraction there only of the anal muscles. Which becomes the mula bandha. The anal lock. Energy locking. The very important part of yogic practices is mudra and bandhas. In that bandhas, there are three bandhas mainly. And then fourth one, this is one bandha, mula bandha. Which is helpful in later stages of yoga to awaken your kundalini shakti. The energy, the serpent power which is lying down in the lower regions. You have to contract your anal muscles and hold. Relaxation. Now the next part comes for your Uriyana Bandha, the abdomen region, Karpu region. For that, stand up first. Practicing, you can do in Vajrasana, but for beginners, standing. Keep little gap. Bend your knees, Mokaldo. Hands on knees like this. Bend your knees little front. Now first preparatory movement. What you have to do is breathe out. Sans Baha. Exhale. Stop the breathing. Try to move your abdomen muscles in and out. In and out. Do slowly first. Contract. Expand. Contract. Slow. In and out. Pull, push. Kadupu, lopala, baitiki, movement stain. Contract and expand. Contract and expand. With breath holding outside actually. Breathe out, stop and try to do. Naturally, those who are very serious patients of heart or any blood pressure, don't do any breath holding exercises. Now, finally, contract and stop. Breathe out, contract and stop. Squeezing. Kadupu. Pet ko achha andar khichiye or roki. Contract and stop. This becomes Udhyana Bandha. One or two times. Breathe in a normal. Now sit down back into the Vajrasana. Malli Vajrasana Lakur Chandi. Third Bandha is the Jalandara Bandha. Jala is the net, the net of your all nervous system and everything in the throat. Guntu Bhagam. All of you sit straight. Only head will go down, chin in the chest. Throat contract. Guntu. Contract your throat and hold. Normal breathing. Contract your throat and stop. 
then release it head up. This is simple like that, but very important and effective. You can breathe in and do. Breathe in, inhale, and then contract your throat muscles, gonto yoka muscles, gale ki manspeshiyon ko sankuchit ki jiye, chuddi chhati me, chin in the chest or in the throat. Head down, lowering your head. Release, breathing out, exhale, and normal. Same breathing out can also be done. You can do anyway. Breathe out. Same. And return. Relax it. These are the three bandhas. There are many practices in this further. Today this much enough. Practice these. Any questions you can ask tomorrow or today after the thing. Now breathe out. You have to exhale. Bhastrika. Give the strokes in breathing out. Exhale with a force and contract your abdomen. Con forcefully exhale chain. Shwasa vadalesi karpulopala. Petko andar kicho. Once you are having good practice, you can do faster. But slowly, gradually, one by one stroke in the beginning. Not reverse. Breathe out, contract. Breathe out, contract. Karupu lopal vellan. Exhale, contract. Exhale, contract. Breathe out. Breathe out. Change. Karte jau. It should be continued. Breathe out. Exhalation. You are only exhaling rapidly, contracting your abdomen muscles. Now, second part, full bhastrika. Bhastrika actually is the bellowing the breath. It is a one of the pranayama. It comes under pranayama. So breathe in, breathe out both. Breathe in, expand. Breathe out, contract. Give the strokes. Beginning, let it be slow. In, out. In, out. Expand, contract. Pet ko phulana, saas leke. Chhod ke anda. Shwaas apilus to karpo baita. Vadal to lopala. Try chain. Saas lena chodana. In, out. In, out. In, out. This is the bellowing the breaths. Bellows. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Try. These are very important kriyas. Which regularize your breathing. Indirectly control your mind, removes the phlegm from the body, improves the for problems of the cold related cough and all these such troubles, ventilation of the lungs and reduction of the any problems related to the digestive system, abdomen, etc. Relax now. Deep breathing. You will have the breathing automatically slow. Make it more slow with your effort. Inhale. Exhale. Totally. Very slowly inhale. 
exhale chala nidhananga shwasa pilustu mellaga odale inhale slow can you control and regulate your breathing process you just see क्या हम अपनी सांसों को धीरे धीरे लेकर छोड़ सकते हैं मन मन के द्वारा वेन यू आर ब्रीदिंग इन एक्सपैंड योर एबडोमन ब्रीदिंग आउट कंट्रैक्ट योर एबडोमन एबडोमिनल ब्रीदिंग और इवन इट इज कॉल्ड एज डायफ्रामेटिक ब्रीदिंग ट्राई long inhalation long exhalation breathe in breathe out have a control on the breaths now for the summer season वन मोर क्रिया विल बी वेरी हेल्पफुल शीतली प्राणायाम शीतली टेक योर टंग आउटसाइड राउंड मेक इट अ राउंड ब्रीद इन थ्रू द माउथ इनहेल नोर द्वारा श्वास अपी लुचको एंड नो दियर टू ब्रीद आउट tang like a beak of a bird jeeb ko round tube banai aur wahan se saans ko andar bhariye naak se chhod dijiye nor dwara aa naal kanu tube laga chesi gali ni lopal teeskondi mukk to vadle नोर बन टू थ्री टाइम्स दिस इज शीतली इन समर सीजन इट गिव्स ए लॉट ऑफ हेल्प और अदर टाइम ऑल्सो दो गेट स्लीपिंग फॉर लॉन्ग जस्ट सिटिंग हर बार नींद आते रहता है दिस क्रिया हेल्प से लॉन्ग टू अवॉइड द अननेसेसरी स्लीप now another form of this kriya is shitali put your tongue to the teeth inside and you can clench your teeth there are two variety small small in that shitakari same breathe in through the mouth breathe out through the nose shitali shitakari sadanta when you clench your teeth together and breathe in that is sadhan or simply also tongue is touching above or to the teeth next kriya bhramari bhramari is the tumme da the honey bee sound normally it is famous in market to close your ears and do and all we don't first because later on these are all not necessary they are not wrong okay we can do for beginners but normally you have to do without any using hands or fingers bhramari is actually the humming sound with breathing in and breathing out both breathing in is a bhranga nada breathing out is the bhrangi nada how just i will show once and then you can go breathing in you have to create a sound little louder this is breathing in now
this is exhaling the breathing out makara sound try two times more Now become silent. Few moments. Observe that vibrations. Be silent. Slow breaths going on. Prashan tanga unandi. Be silent and be relaxed. शांति थैंक यू धन्यवाद दैट वॉज द टुडे स्पेशन टुमारो some more we can add if any questions if any of the doubts uh, there was a, i think in chat box it is for me or what that question was there regarding gyana yoga uh gyana yoga it actually starts with a statement brahma satyam jagat mithya jiva brahma eva namara the brahman is only the satya all jagat is mithya and jiva is only the brahma it is not separate and to realize this it is possible through the discrimination and renunciation one has to discriminate separate ourselves i am not body i am not mind i am not all the because why we are feeling because of maya so adi shankara acharya ji gives the vishishta maya vada or advaita siddhanta in that how to achieve this goal he gives the sadhana chatushtayam that is viveka vairagya shatsampat and mumukshatvam these are the some practices which are given in the gyana yoga viveka here it is discrimination what is to discriminate i am not body i am not the mind i am not the senses i think you all know it shankara acharyas that very famous uh, you may find on youtubes and very nice song shivoham 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 i am not the body i am not the sciences i am not that so viveka is that every moment we have to differentiate ourselves i am the real vairagya is the renunciation you have to get detachment of it is all big subject i cannot go in 2 minutes shatsampat <laughs> actually these are the six types of uh, uh, practices given by the Uh, shankara acharya ji into that uh, which is very important they are the practices of sama dama uparati titiksha 
श्रद्धा एंड समाधान ईच वन इट टेक्स अ लॉन्ग टाइम साम इज द कामनेस डाम इज द सेल्फ कंट्रोल उपरती इज द मेंटल रिस्ट्रेन टू द एक्सटर्नल ऑब्जेक्ट्स titiksha is the deep to mental calmness in the circumstances and shraddha is in the teacher and samadhana is the self settledness this is sat sampat which has been and mumukshatvam is the last which says the earning for the desire to get that moksha manalo adi undali that thing that i want to get moksha not going under the maya so this is the shat sampat explained by the adi shankaracharya i cannot go in details more regarding another question i think in chat i saw uh, navavida bhakti that comes under bhakti yoga we will talk and i think prabhu sir and all that and all the many experts they can give you the more answer on this now if any questions or any doubts on the session or any practical part you can ask thank you sir okay any questions there is one more uh, there are no questions on the chat box uh, he has already replied yeah yeah right puroji has already replied so there are no questions on the chat box And there are no questions outside also now uh, vishwanath garu we uh, thank uh, the doctor puroji very nice thank you please chant prarthana okay. om satye prajapya paripalayantam nyayena margena mahimai shaha gro brahmanebhya shubha vastu nityam ोभवंतुकाशतुपर्जन्यीसिणी सुखिनरामयाद्राणी पश्यंत मचि दुख भाग भवे ओं शाति 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 ओम पूर्णमध पूर्ण विधम पूर्णात् पूर्ण मुदच्यते पूर्ण से पूर्णमादाय पूर्णमेवशिष्य शाति 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 सर्वे जना सुखिनो स्वस्ति हरि ओम धन्यवाद धन्यवाद मैं विश्वनाथ गारू थैंक यू सो मच ना लेटेस्ट गो फॉर जनगण मन जनगणमन अधिनायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विधाता पंजाब सिंधु गुजरात मराठा द्राविड उत्कल बंगा विंध्य हिमाचल यमुना गंगा उच्छल जलधि तरंगा तव शुभ नामे जागे तव शुभ आशीष मांगे गाहे तव जय गाथा जन गण मंगल दायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विधाता जय हे जय हे जय हे जय 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 हे जय जय धन्यवाद मैं चला चिटी बाबू आ